Dozen Selection. Sani David ambaye anazidi kutamba na kutamba kwa kasi na ngoma zaidi ya 15 kwenye albamu yake mpya ya Timeless. Kwa mara ya kwanza amefunguka ni kwa nini hakumshirikisha msanii yeyote kutoka Tanzania katika albamu hiyo. Akizungumza na Amazon Music katika podcast ya Plus 44 kama moja ya mahojiano anayoendelea kuyafanya kuisukuma zaidi ya albamu yake. Alisema kuwa anagopa sana kufanya muziki na msanii alafu mashabiki wa msanii pinzani kwa hiyo msanii waanze kumshambulia. Na nakuwa alichosema Davido nikienda Tanzania kwa mfano na nifanya collab na msanii huko alafu nirudi nyumbani nianze kuwa na comment na kejeli na matusi pengine msanii huyo ana mpinzani na mashabiki wa mpinzani wake wamechizi kwamba nilikwenda huko unajua kitu kama hicho kitakubadilisha kabisa jinsi ulivyokuwa na waza have you ever seen twitter space with like african artists your twitter following is crazy. is crazy like when they go ham they go ham and i'm get what you mean like somebody from that camp doesn't yeah, like really? yeah, it's crazy go, they, i'd like boy cut the album yeah, they, no it's no, crazy like no. they leaked my album they yeah, leaked it yeah somebody got a wind of the album and it's just like Okay for example like these standships mm. obviously my fans now I can't get to all of them but there's one person I can call him like yo talk talk to them tell them to come down like that's oh, really? okay cool that's kind of cool So like before the album came out I call I called one of them I was like look last time I dropped my album you guys like were just bashing everybody so when it was like my turn to come out right there were just unnecessary things happened like even Nikki called me Nikki Minaj Little baby were like yo why are you why are this like go in and fast with DM them why did you why did you do a song with David Oh my god have you have you watched Swarm No, no I've watched it like one episode This is just like yeah, that Yes yes that's oh, the girl was a fan and, yeah. and I started, I made a video and I said yo artists need to start telling their fans yo you love me too much I love you but love me less because yes. if you're going to start that bashing other people for me that's so too I much So I think now so like before <laughs> the album came I said look I don't want any any I was like look I was even with Whiskey that earlier this week So just so, chill out yeah yeah you don't have to tweet anybody or say uh, this yeah. one in past if you like it just you, say you like it because i won't lie to you i will say effects sometimes mm. you know what i'm saying like i remember this one for a fact like when they were tweeting nikki like basically made not even do the video because it's a mental wow. thing like if i sit on my phone i'm like ah. yeah if i do if i go to tanzania for example and i do a song with an artist there and yeah. i get back home mm. and i'm saying like hate comments mm, mm, mm. or maybe the artist I did a song with he has a rival yeah, yeah. and the Amanda I came and yeah, 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 you know yeah, what I'm saying yeah. it can change your line yeah, of yeah, yeah, yeah. do you understand so like I learned a lot from like my previous album right okay and this is my first album where I didn't feature any US artist right and was you was, or any international artist I just featured like people I know and like Africans was that deliberate I see that skept that like he's a mm. Nigerian brother so 